Hello everyone, welcome back to reacting to Dorman hashtag 18. Today we are reacting to Bullies Break Poor iPhones. No, Bullies Break Poor Students iPhone in class. What happens next is shocking. I'm so excited to, to react to Dorman for another time. This is reacting to Dorman hashtag 18. Bullies Break Poor Students iPhone in class. What happens next is shocking. I'm so excited to get into this. This is going to be a great video. Let's just get into it. Just got me a job? At the smoothie shop. Your dad knows the owner. What? No, no, I asked for a new iPhone, not a job. You... I get what her parents are trying to do. They're giving him a job so he can make money to get an iPhone. Smart. Didn't ask. You demanded. A job is a great gift, Andrew. When I was 16, my dad got me my first job. I learned a lot. So will you. What do you expect me to learn at a smoothie shop? The anatomy of a banana? How to get made fun of? You will learn the value of hard work. For start. Yes, his dad is right. If you work hard at a job, you're going to get paid ching ching. If you work hard at a job, you'll get paid tons and tons of ching ching. Yes, it's not going to be that much. You'll probably make only minimum wage per hour, but you're still making enough ching ching to buy what you want and help out. And the value of hard work for starters. You guys even hear yourselves? Hey, you watch that attitude right there. Getting everything you want has made you a spoiled <sighs> brat. Mark, Mark. What? It is true. Look at it this way, sweetheart. Whatever money you make is yours to spend however you want. You can buy the iPhone you want, a car, whatever. Mom, please. Don't make me do this. He's losing it. It's already done. And if you intentionally do a bad job, well, we'll just find you a new one. Only a genius or psychopath can solve this. What the hell is this? They say you're smart. So, can you solve it? I get you can't. I don't care what the hell that was. Job? Well, we'll just find you a new one. I thought he was going to say he would fire you. Like, I was just thinking in my head. Well, you'll just get fired then, and you can't make any money. But he just said, well, just find you a new one. Whatever, this is insane. You guys are the worst. Um, don't be that way, Andrew, no. please. Bro, don't be that mean to your parents. The dad is trying to be, you know, being truthful and honest, but the mom is just trying to, you know, make him feel better. I'm done. I don't know about this mark we are doing the right thing that boy needs to learn how to live in the real world yes he does because he's Do very spoiled me? of course i like the green though yes sir. oh that's crazy oh, oh watch where you're going man Watch that floor. It picks up pretty fast. <laughs> that's funny. Hey, that's a bit mean. Okay, what the hell is that? This is 2024. If you still do not have a... If you do not have a smartphone... I, I'm sorry for your loss. More on a joking matter. If you're gonna have a phone... In 2024, if someone says they have a phone... They mean a smartphone. Like, there is literally no one, and I mean no one left on the planet, that if they say they have a phone, it's not a smartphone. Okay, I'm not judging, but there's very few more people that don't have a smartphone, that just don't have a smartphone at this age. If you're over 16, there's an 80% chance you have a smartphone. Like at, like, at my age, if you're over 12, there's only a 20% chance you have a smartphone, which is very low. Okay, let's just get into this, because I do not want to make this video too long. Oh, no, did I break it? Come on. Well, hey, look on the bright side. Now you can get a new one. That phone's older than you, man. Upgrade. Oh. 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 Speaking of old busted phones, you get that new iPhone for your birthday yet? Uh... Yeah, yeah, totally. Uh, let's see it. Well, I, I couldn't actually bring it today. I need to get a... Let me guess, your parents didn't get you it. Ha ha. Case for it. So maybe tomorrow. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Well, yo, 
We still playing Call of Duty after school? Yeah. All right. All right. I can't. I gotta. I gotta do some stuff. But like maybe, maybe tonight. <sighs> Seriously, bro, blow it off. Unless it's a girl. Yeah. yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Dude, no way. Whoa. Who is it? What's I don't know. I don't. Kiss and tell, you know. Dude, no. oh, Fred, man, I'll catch you later. Like, I'm real late again. Hey, I, I, I'm not late. I've never been late. This is our little slice of smoothie heaven. So Looks pretty nice. I'd love to work there. Here's your shirt. Your apron's hanging up right over there. That store and looks really nice. I'd love to work there. Me. Like, look how nice that store looks. Great. It is really, really nice. Oh, speaking of, here he is. Andrew, Eugene, Eugene, Andrew. I told Andrew you show him the ropes. Yes, sir. Wow, you work here oh, too. Oh no! Bully Jeez, meets nerd. Bully meets nerd. Bully Boss meets said we nerd. Were a new employee today named Andrew. I really didn't expect it to be you. Yeah, well, look, I'm not thrilled to be here either. So let's just get this over with, huh? Well, the boss wants me to train you. So here's the recipe chart. Ice is the base for most of them. They also have... All right, all right, all right. Okay, look. Bro, it's a smoothie shop. I'm sure if you can do all this stuff, I'll excel at it, huh? So don't trip. Okay. I bet you money that he is going to, you know... This is going to be very hard for him. Just push this button. I got it. I bet you money that this is going to be very, very hard for him, and he's going to struggle and get fired, and ooh, ooh, ooh. Hey, hey, hey. Uh, I said I had it, man. You're not my boss. Sorry about that. Here you go. Have a good one. Don't worry. You'll figure it out. I had it figured out. You just got in my way. I wasn't getting in your way. I was I was just trying to make sure the customer wasn't getting angry. Our first job is customer service. Oh, our first job is customer service. Do you even hear how lame you sound? Look, the cash register is hard. Don't be embarrassed. If it... I'm not embarrassed, okay? I could do I think you are embarrassed. This is my sleep, man. You're just breathing down my neck and it distracts me. I think he's just getting embarrassed because he keeps going to the nerd. I'm so much better than you, you suck. But I think he's finally realizing he's kind of crap as well. Like everyone gets embarrassed, bro. You don't have to, you don't have to be embarrassed that you get embarrassed as well. Customers. Yeah. Welcome to the smooth operator. Oh. Oh my God. <laughs> Andrew. Yo! Wow! <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Andrew! What are you doing here? Yo, uh, nice apron, dude. <laughs> Yo, man, what? What happened? Did, 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 you, did your parents go broke or something? <laughs> nah. Hey, Andrew, we have dishes in the back that need to be done. <gasps> oh, back. Oh, oh, you're yeah. a dishwasher. Dish, dude. At a smoothie place. Yo, yo, wait, wait. wait. You telling me you work with you, 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 Gina? Yeah, yeah, I thought you were going to be with some, uh, new girl after school yeah guys let's uh let's get out of here uh, yeah i've lost my appetite anyway don't be don't be friends with those kind of weirdos those people are only friends with popular people and you only stay around popular people if you do that you're a sheep you don't matter you are a loser a real loser those kind of people call you a loser, but a real loser is someone that literally goes around, hangs out with people, and if you're not cool enough, get out. And all, and they're just a sheep. Sheep people make fun of people. You're a real loser, then. The dork looks contagious. <sighs> Great. What am I supposed to do now? Get used to it, I guess. Who asked you, huh? You literally just asked me. What? Well Bros try to use the who asked you. I don't need advice from a nerd. I'm going on break. Sorry about that. Hey, you left before getting your share of our tips.
Thanks. What are you saving for? Rent. I work to help my grandparents. Grandparents? Let me guess, your parents died in a car crash. Dorman, Dorman keeps using the same thing over again. Like your parents died in a car crash. Your parents burnt. You get the point. Like they need to change up a bit. I bet you the subs I bet you that subscriber button that the parents died in a car crash. If they did, you better subscribe. What about your parents? And if they parents? didn't, you're allowed to unsubscribe. They died in a car accident three years ago. Haha, <laughs> knew it. So, if you were betting against me, now you have to subscribe. Haha, <laughs> you don't get to unsubscribe. I... I didn't know. So, what, your grandparents just make you work all the time and pay rent, or...? <laughs> they don't make me. They're too old to work, so... If I help out, it's the least I can do. Don't you get tired of... Working and going to school, like, all the time? It's just life. If I don't work, we'd be living on the street. Besides, work has taught me a lot. Like what? Appreciate what you have while you have it. Bye. Oh, now the bully's gonna learn to appreciate things while he has it. Ooh. Dorman is just too predictable. What one thing Dorman should do is stop being so damn predictable. Dorman is just so 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 predictable that the stories aren't even interesting anymore. What I think is just Dorman should start being a bit more, a little less predictable. I never knew how hard my parents worked until I started working myself. Wish I appreciate them. A Sorry. A little bit more. While they were still here. Go. See you tomorrow. Finally, the spoiled bull. Finally, the spoiled bully learned his lesson. Good for him. He should have learned his lesson a long time ago. Hey, sweetie. Oh. One game has been no, no, it's an ad. Help me, help me. <laughs> so now I get the silent treatment, huh? Earth to Andrew. Andrew is starting to think about why he's so damn spoiled. Oh, I'm sorry. I was wondering, do you guys think you could still get me the iPhone? <laughs> I'll, I, I'll pay you back. I'll give you half of my paychecks. I even got some tip money, too. I think that sounds fair. Yeah. Thanks. Finally, Andrew does something that's actually good and fair. Instead of doing something that's horrendously horrible. Yes, brother, wear glasses, man. Thank you for the fuck. Ah! Oh! Hey, stop it, guys. What's wrong with you? Eugene, you okay? Sticking up for your new bestie now or what? Man, shut up. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Are you for real? You are picking the nerd over- Yes, he's for real. Now shut up before I get my nerf gun. Wait, I mean exot gun. Us? Yeah, I am picking the nerd over you guys. You, you guys are jerks. You're a jerk. <laughs> I thought we made it clear to you yesterday at your job that we don't want to be your friends anymore anyway. Mm -hmm. You know, oh, he got that treatment. You know what? That's fine, all right? <coughs> it's mutual. Okay. I'm 
I'm sorry about that, man. Are you okay? Finally, he's finally being nice to the bully. He's been so long, he's being nice to the bully. After so, so, so long, he's being nice to the bully. Why do I keep saying that? It's me on screen. Oh. Why did I disappear? I'm back again. Why did I disappear? No, I disappeared. Okay, let's just continue watching now. Yeah, yeah, I'm good. Uh, <clears throat> why are you being so nice? Listen, man, I understand that you've been through a lot with your grandparents and everything, and I just... I shouldn't have treated you the way I did. And I'm sorry. It's okay. Uh, thanks. Just to show you how sorry I really am, I... I got you something... Ooh, his parents are watching. Ooh. I felt bad about breaking your phone. So you got so him the new iPhone. I'll show you how sorry I am. Just take it, man. It's for you. Uh, 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 are you serious? Yeah, cheers. Oh, my God. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, sure, man. Uh, that might have been... I'm sorry. It's fine, it's fine. Mm. Uh, thanks again. See you at work. See you, Eugene. Uh. You were right after all. Spoiled son refuses to get a job. I might actually watch that. <laughs> okay, thank you for watching everybody and I hope you have a great day. This has been a good video. See you next time.